thing. Let me put that in. Because I feel like people might be looking for these. I know the pitcher sells for good money. All right, today I am at the Goodwill. We haven't been here in a while. Today I'm by myself, but our next video, I promise Michael will be with me. <laughs> On the way here, I stopped at a garage sale and found something awesome. I found this. It's Viking glass handkerchief um, compote. Usually when I think of a handkerchief, I think of the uh, points being more pointier. This is more round, but I only paid, guess this, $2. <laughs> it needs to be clean, but I'm fine with that. All right, let's get inside. All right, let's go see what the color of the day is. Looks like it's yellow. Let me get this cart. All right, go over here where we usually start. These are kind of neat. It's made of paper. What the heck? <laughs> We have some crystal shades. Ooh, those are pretty. Look at the look at it in the light. That's still there. It's 40% off. Royal Gallery made in Italy. Um, I don't really see too much resale value in that. Ooh. Uh, that's nice. I like that pattern. All right, let's go over here. I have all these frogs. Those are for the garden. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> Plastic plates there. What about this down here? It's a print. It's like, um... Italy, maybe. Some heels. Okay. Go over here and see if there's anything new. It has been a while since we've been here. Uh, some teacups. German. Um, so when I look for the teacups, I'm looking for like the chintz. A nice pottery votive with mountains on it. It's only two ninety nine. I have a cute bear bank. <laughs> I don't see any markings on it. Leave that for four ninety nine. A pear. We have over here. A lot of flowers. Shot glasses are kind of cool. I wonder if this is uranium. I doubt it. <laughs> yeah, looking kind of bare. Alright, I see something cool over here. Right up here. Huh. Is that treasure craft? It's not. It's USA or California pottery. How much is that? $15.99. Ooh, do I get it? Ah, I think I have to get it even though $15.99. That goes in. Make sure there's no chips or cracks. Nothing there. Ooh, yes. All right, let's see what else we have. I have this cute puppy. <laughs> uh, it's probably made in China. It's still cute though, it's a resin. Nice pottery. So I think that's a Raku. It has a iridescent on the outside. Oh, the Stangle. We saw this last time. It doesn't have too much 
um, resale value. Ooh, a nice ginger jar. Um, and it has a lot of scratches on it for $7.99. I'll have to leave. What else do we have? I think these are for beer. Oh, looks like a golf ball. <laughs> Anything else? Oh, this is a cool um, wood basket. $7.99. It's actually lighter than I thought. Um, all right, let's go over here. Some canisters. What about this lady? Huh, I don't know. Kind of looks like a... At first I thought it was an art deco and then kind of looks like a gypsy. <laughs> what about this fruit plate? I can already tell it's transferred on. Yeah. CT. Hand painted. Oh, $3.99. I'll leave that. What about this? Sailboat. Oh, it's one of those, um, engravings for the people, lithographer. I can't believe that. Ooh, what about this? What about the underplate? It kind of looks like the, um, Brock, Brockware. Remember I bought the underplate for the gravy boat? I think it is. Yeah. Maybe we have more teacups over here. I think I like this one with a blue handle. It has some floral on the inside and outside. That's oh, Stafford chair. I know I'm gonna put that in and look it up because not all of these type of teacups go for a lot. But I'll research that a little bit. What else do we have down here? Some crystal. I don't know about that. <laughs> There's that weird martini glass. I always like that cobalt blue. I know some people collect just that cobalt blue color. Coach stoneware. We have this cute teapot. Huh. Made in China. Ooh, look at these little um, trinket boxes. Um, looks like it's for golf. And it closes. Let's see about the other one. I don't see any damage. I know people collect golf stuff. They're only $2 each. That goes in the cart. <laughs> All right. Let me see what's over here. Looks like it would have been an Italian. Nice candle holder. How much is that? $5.99. Andrea. Look at these tin canisters. It says Hummel on it. Mm. Alright, let's go check out this first thing I spotted on this shelf. Looks like it could be Bohemian. Um, I don't know. It doesn't feel like it's cut. I see, I see a little bit of a chip there, but that's pretty. Almost looks like the Fenton coined out, but it's not. <laughs> I'll get that for $4.99. A little bit of scratch there. Oh, then I found these. Hand-painted, made in Italy for $6 for the pair. 
feel like I could get like $25, $30 for that. Looks like it could be for jam or a honey. It's pottery. Whoops, almost fell out. Um, I don't know what that mark says. Something N. MN. I don't know, I always like that little swirl design on top. It's pretty. Some redware. I wonder what that's used for. <laughs> Ooh, nice butterfly dish. Special Place 2003. I know I like that um, floral design. For the roses. Ah, the music is playing. Ooh, a butterfly teapot. I don't know why I like butterflies too. Nature's Journey. $4.99. You have the Russian people. Uh, fourteen ninety nine. I know I bought some of these before. They didn't really sell too well. Of all the Santas, that's a trivet there. What are these? They look familiar to me. Party light. How much are they? Seven dollars for the pair. Oh, we have all this red glass. Cork. Let me go down here. The Christmas aisle. Whoops. Ooh, that looks different. I was thinking maybe Avon. Five ninety nine for the pair. Thought maybe this was Spode. It's a porcelain. Um, House of Lily Christmas. Hmm. Oh, look at the little cute angels. Ah, oh, the cherubs. 1997. Two ninety-nine. Put that in. All right. Let's see if this is uh, Yadro. It's not. And we probably looked at it before. This looks like Lennox. It is uh, ten dollars. See, I would get that if it was like four dollars. Uh, we have the Ray Dawn. Oh, the Park Lane. Macasa Park Lane. Twelve dollars for the set. We saw this last time. We thought it was too much for resale. So once that's on sale, I'm gonna get them. Probably get like forty, like thirty dollars, ten dollars a glass. Oh, a nice dish down here. Ten dollars. It's pretty. Have some Fenton hobnail. I think it's Fenton. I'm pretty sure. Um, eight ninety nine though. And a divided dish. Lanita Crystal. Let's tap it. <laughs> oh, it still has the tags on it. $7 for the set of... Ooh, I might have to get these. For a set of six. Alright, I think I'm going to do that. What's over here? I thought it maybe was um, Pyrex, a Spice of Life jar. Have a hand painted wine glass, or champagne. Oh, it looks like somebody just painted it at home. We have uh, anchor hocking. Bubble bubble pattern, I think. Uh, four ninety nine. If it was red or green, I would get it. <laughs> and it looks like I'm leaving a lot of stuff behind, but it's part of reselling. A nice crystal. Salt and pepper shakers there. Ooh, look at these. Four ninety nine. That's like a twenty dollar sale. Anything down here? 
some silver plated. Don't see any markings on that. All right, go to the black section. Oh, these are still here. I like them. <laughs> Has the sun on it. Oh boy, I can't even pick that up. Cast iron. Uh, sixty dollars. Something where you could crush your herbs in there. I thought maybe that was a uh, black glass amethyst. Nice Chinese. Um, oh, somebody already peeled it. Chinese teacup. God, I like that pattern. Almost looks like the pattern that it was made in. Made for JC Penney's. Can't remember that. The name. You yeah, have some nice low ball glasses. Sperm whales. <laughs> Alright, well, the Sadler teapot still isn't lower than. $29.99. Once it's ten, about $10, I'm going to get it. Comes with a sugar and creamer. It's pretty. <laughs> I like that shape too. What about these dishes back here? I like that pink. Pink leaves. What does that say in the back? W.S. George. Let me see if they all say that. Yep. Ooh. $20 for the stack of plates. Hmm. I'm going to have to look that up. Oh, look at these cute cat, and cat salt and pepper shakers made in Taiwan. Ah, oh, I wish they were a dollar. Is this a Target bird? Creative Design yeah, Limited, so California cool. warning. Stay away. <laughs> Down here, these look like they could be Fenton. Uh, Eight ninety nine for the pair. You have the sugar and creamer. All right, let me put that in. So I feel like people might be looking for these. I know the pitcher sells for good money. All right, go and see what they have in the lamps. Nice oil lamp with a shade. Usually the maker is on that little knob. It's electri electrified, so I don't know, the shade alone could probably sell well. If you see the green, they'll sell for good money. It's cast iron. Looks like one of those, um, what is it called? At a restaurant where they serve you everything on here for quesadillas. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> nice tiger eye <laughs> lamp. Huh, I've seen too much in the kitchen. Let's go over and look at the art. Oh, the first thing I see are these black cats. I wonder if that's for Halloween. <laughs> it's kind of neat. $12.99. I like the glitter ears. What do we have in the art? Ooh, we have a cool picture. Ooh, it's light. I have the trees and the wind. Oh, that's kind of neat. $8.99. I like that. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> it goes in the cart. It's so neat. Have a little bit of damage there, but that could be fixed. Take a look at these. 
It looks like art glass with the gold in the background. It looks like it's for Jewish. Oh my god, that's cool. I like the glass. The gold on the background. 16 for the pair, though. I guess I'll wait for those to go on sale. I just thought they were cool. Anything over here? No, nothing. I right, saw so my reseller friend that I bump into at Goodwill Salvation Army found me this fused glass. It's a sign A cross on the back. It's worth more than $4.99. That goes in the cart. It has a sailboat, a lighthouse. I think that's pretty. Usually you see the floral design. Careful. All right, over here, someone did a little <laughs> home project with an Indiana glass. <laughs> Actually, it looks kind of cool, but it says reversible. That's awesome. Ooh, we have um some M&Ms and glass. $12.99. Have that again. Is that on sale? No. This looks like Stangle. $19.88. Oh, it's not. It is signed, though. I can't read that. I think I need my glasses. Come on, back here. Have the silver band. I think they call it Queenswear. What does that say on the bottom? Is that Libby? How much is that? $3.99 for the set. Ain't too bad, but I have some at home that I have, haven't even listed yet. So I gotta get on that tonight. It's false graph. Oh, look at the Mickey Mouse. Ah, reach it. Oh, I always like Mickey Mouse. Four ninety nine. Um, I don't think we looked at this end cap yet. Yeah, we have a brown and cream. Ooh, look at this alligator. Looks like it'd be made in India, maybe. Seven ninety nine. Oh, that's awesome. Love it. Look at these hearts. It's just an art project. This is too. Ooh, I like that. I like the colors on it. Oh you yeah, look at these cool elephant mugs. Nature's home. Oh, I like that. Do I want it for myself? Now, I actually want a Mackenzie Child mug. A little pricey, but I have a copper, hammered copper wall plate. Made in Ireland. $3.99 ain't too bad. We have these crosses. Ooh, those are heavy. A bag of shells. <laughs> Harker wear. Nice bamboo pattern. All right, I think I'm going to check out and I'll give you the total in the car. All right, so my total spend was $58. I'm happy with everything I got, but I think my favorite is this California pottery. I love this kind of green. It's a 1970s type green. It kind of looks like treasure craft, but it's not. It's um, California pottery. All right, and I also got the teacup and saucer. Um, it's Staffordshire. I believe this pattern is called Forget Me Not, but I only paid $5.99. I feel like I could get a lot more for it. All right, I'm going to go home and try to list some of these items. And thank you, everybody, for following us and shopping along with me. And I'll see you next time. Bye.